Good morning, Gloucester. EJ here. Right now I'm at the Mad Fish Grill down here on Mad Fish Wharf on Rocky Neck. And um, at this moment we're kind of taking a look at the sushi bar. We've got a couple of people who have just sat down and decided to have some of just removing great sushi. And we've just finished having this massive, we haven't even finished, we've got this massive thunderstorm that's just finishing going on, so it's kind of quiet in here because everyone's still taking cover out by the bar. But I'm going to do a little pan here so everybody can see the um, really lovely dining room. Manfish has a great space out looking over the water. And we've got a little reggae music going on in the back. Actually, it's Thursday, so there will be reggae playing here tonight, although you won't see this until tomorrow, but uh, they have a great reggae night here on Thursday night. Great music Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday here at the Madfish Grill. And in a minute, we're gonna, <coughs> we're gonna meet Nikki Hearn and some of her great staff here. Okay, now I'm in the bar at Madfish. Um, we've got some of the people here that are weathering out the storm and enjoying the uh, great ambiance here. There's a lot of people, everybody's having fun. In a few hours, we'll be rocking. Okay, here we are now in the back room at Madfish, and we've got Nikki Ahern and Jenny Sullivan. Uh, Nikki's the proprietress here at Madfish Grill and the Madfish Wharf Gallery, and Jen, um, Jenny, Jeannie, Jeannie, sorry, is um, okay. is the bar manager. I just want to say one just quick thing about uh, Nikki. Since I've come here to Madfish, uh, where I went the Con Studio and Good Morning Gloucester Gallery space, Nikki has just been the most amazing person. She has been so helpful and just made a really challenging time of opening up a new gallery and uh, you know all the moving and the whole process just made it so much easier and it's just been such a joy to work with. And so I want this opportunity for people out there who maybe haven't been to the Madfish to get to know her and to get to know a little bit about the restaurant and what a great place this is. And um, so, Nikki, you and you, you've been running the Mad Fish now for how many years? Thirteen years. Thirteen years. And um, you originally ran it with your husband, Frank, yeah. who passed away, and then you've taken over running it on your own. Now, Nikki's amazing because she's, you know, she's she's a widow, has two young boys, and um, just runs just an amazing operation here between the restaurant and all the gallery spaces and shops. And um, she just does it and just and you know, just keep smiling and getting things done. And uh, and Jeannie does a great job with uh, running the bar. And Jeannie, how long have you been here? Um, I've been down the name for 14 years. I started up at the studio when Frank and Nikki and the studio in Memphis. And then, so that was 14 years ago. Exclusively down here, I would say for Yeah, after my husband died, I took Jeannie. Yeah. He told me to go. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Wrong later. Yeah. So, and you guys, you guys have been friends for a long time too. Yeah, that's right. Family, yeah. 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 Well, that's great because you need that in this kind of an operation. You need to have people that you can depend on. That you know, yeah. have you back. Yeah. And um, so it's Nick, a short season, but people don't realize it's stressful. Like all jammed into just a couple of months. Of really yeah, and this one. Uh, well, I've seen it since I've been here. It's just yeah. all the stuff you have to get done to get yeah. this place ready yeah. is um, just. Huge. I try to go opening a new restaurant every year, you know, and then if you have new staff, that even just makes it harder. We are lucky enough that yeah, it is the kind of place that people return to year after year. Yeah. I mean, we have staff that have been here five years. We have a bartender in the yeah. yeah, I was a waitress here yeah. when she started, yeah. actually. Really? My first yeah. waitress here, yeah. that's why I met Frank. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, that's yeah. cool. Yeah. So that's how you met? You met yeah. here? Yeah, love well, at first play, actually. Uh -oh. That's sweet. Yeah, on, both, on both sides, yeah. Now, one thing I wanted to just um, let people know about, um, you've got all sorts of great um, dishes here. I'll put the menu up along with this so people can see the, uh, what the offerings are. They've also just recently opened a wonderful sushi bar, and I put a post up about that earlier, yeah, but I'll, I'll, I'll include that again because I just, I just caught some people going over yeah. to the sushi bar to get some sushi. And another thing that's important for people to know, Nikki really tries to um, use local businesses whenever she can, and she's now buying her lobsters from the most awesome lobster place on Cape Ann, Captain Joe and Sons. And she also um, buys uh, 
stock spirits from Ryan and Wood's distilleries, which, um, you know, we know Bob Ryan is a great guy, and so she, she starts to... Oh, and Cape Ram Brewery, too. There we go. Yeah, Cape Ram Brewery. So, you know, that's, like, if you like to if you like to drink local beverages, um, you can get them here. And also great music. Um, I want to talk about the music you've got coming up. Um, well, we're doing, on Thursday night, um, we're doing reggae with uh, a younger band at our Sunday nights, and they have a lot of original stuff, and they just started out about a year ago, and they're doing really, really great. Two of the guys have been doing reggae. Yeah. Two of the Soul Rebel, well, yeah. Soul Rebel Project. I personally love that band. I think they're just awesome. They're so nice. Yeah. And then we try to um, mix it up on Friday and Saturdays with songs, blues, or, you know, whatever. Danceable. Um, and Sundays, we've had the same reggae band for 13 years. Um, Jack Lee and yeah. University. Yeah. yeah. I mean, they're, they're repetitive, but uh, it's, it's the tradition here. Well, yeah. people obviously love them because I see the lineup out there, yeah. you know, of people waiting to get into the place, so yeah. they obviously love them. And then we're going to start off our drag queen shows. Um, it's not Wednesdays anymore, it's going to be Sunday. It's the only night we could get um, for two Sundays a month. I'm looking forward to that, getting yeah. some video of that. Um, <laughs> last year, every single show that we had was sold out, like, the Thursday before oh, my show, God. and the show was the following Wednesday. They're great. Day. Yeah, 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 they really got on this year. Yeah, they're raunchy and funny. And, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, I mean, if you're a guy, just know you're going to get played, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. No, don't act. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm comfortable. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And then Wednesday, we're going to be doing karaoke. No. With, um, Mama Donna, who I hear is great and a lot of fun. Um, so that's what yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, and that's going to be every Wednesday. And I guess that wraps it up for the music stuff. But um, we have a very proud. We have anywhere from early 20s to your 60s, and it all seems to just match nicely, actually. Mm -hmm. You know? Um, I've been here enough times dancing, and yeah. I, I've seen that. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's just, it, you know, we're, yeah, we're all like family here. Where, you know, a lot of places they have their little and, you know, new people don't get as good as shit. We, we try to make it, you know, good yeah. Fair and equitable for everybody. You know, and, and I think it shows because a lot of them do come back every year, you know. Well, I can hear that big storm coming back in again. We got thunder crashing, and so I'm going to wrap it up. But I just want to tell tell everybody to come down here and join the Madfish family, and come down here for dinner, come down here to dance, come down to Madfish Wharf because there's so much rock and stuff going on down here with Con Studio and the Good Morning Gloucester Gallery. Wendy Demuth having her grand opening Saturday and Sunday, and um, yeah, come down here and check it out and rock out and have fun. And uh, Good Morning Gloucester. Good morning. Gloucester. Good morning. <laughs>